Hello, we're back. So blue. So blue. Uh, and hmm. full of mushrooms. Where were the... Oh. There's got to be something up there. Where was the... Oh, I love how they this? have the bioluminescent oh, mushrooms, too. That's how I play. As little lamps. I love that. Also, yes, you wanted to get to those two logs while they're here. Oh, is that a larger oh. creature? Look at it. Yeah, it does like a charge. Mm-hmm. Wait, what is this? Oh, no, this probably just gives us spores. Yeah, it gives us a blue spore. I think... Mm-hmm. We might have to figure out what spores are required to open certain paths. Yeah, it uh, looks like you've oh, lost no, your blue that. spores. Slow mo mo. I got inside the rock for a bit? That was concerning. Okay. Looks like it can go up here. Oh. There's a symbol. Yep. Did I get it? I got it. It looks like we're next to the ribs of some giant creature. Yeah. Oh. Those are the kind of lacy mushrooms. Have you ever seen the ones where it's an outer layer of the kind of connected lace, but then, wait a minute, what's that planet? You'll see it when you get up to the top. It's, is that their planet? Oh, it's starting to break up. Yeah. Either that or we've never just seen it at night, but. No, no, no. We've seen it at night, and it was mostly just the cities, but there's definitely cracking now. I wonder if every boss you defeat... Makes it worse? More and more of it. Yeah. I I get the feeling we're not going to win here. Mm -mm. Or that we're caught in a long loop, too. These bones, ancient and colossal. They are from someplace out of space and time, someplace greater than our own. I think these creatures were worshipped. I walk among a graveyard of gods. The team has readied their conduits. Even as our communications fail us, I can feel the star seeds' power growing, its vibrations intensifying. I can barely contain the jubilation. This guy sounds creepy. Mm -hmm. But wasn't he the one that... Things seem to be going well for Pyatt. Hope I can get in touch. Wasn't Pyatt the one that was on the comm with that other character mm -hmm. and they were chanting? Yeah. In some strange tongue? Aw. Well, you might be able to hop up the mushrooms yeah. to it. Mm -hmm. Not even the ones along the side? I think I go go through inside. <laughs> oh, but you need to get to the into it first. Okay. Oh. I don't know how I keep doing that. Maybe you're pressing a button? Yeah, I must be just tapping it. Hmm. Um, that does not look good. Yeah, probably not through there. Mm -mm. If I had a guess. Okay, there's whatever... Oh, wait, no, this is where we started, isn't it? Yeah, that's got to be how we came in. No, it's not. No, that's, that's how where we, we came, came in. in. So what's you might, this? You might want to check what's up there. I don't really need the goo that much. Ooh. Well, there's something... Well, yeah, like that's that. got a big symbol on it. Oh. Oh, oh no. Is this another spore? Mm-hmm. What do you need to get inside this one? A red spore. My assumption is this might be a bit of a time test. Oh, well, there's a red spore to the right. Right there. Oh, yeah. How did you know that you needed the red one? It seemed to correspond with the door. I mean, the first one that we encountered was a red one, and it did require... Yeah. Well, it was required for barrier. Okay. Let's try to go as swiftly as possible. Oh no, it's blinking out. It's gone. So there's got to be something up here then. Yeah, try the yellow one. Oh, or go around the other side. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna look around. Because there is that yellow cone right there. Uh, no, it's just a lamp. Yeah. Well, you could find something further down the cliff on the opposite side. Oh, or, or you can jump in through the back? Is that possible? Nah, you can't get in through that window? No. Shame. Yeah, why don't you try going down this cliff? Just on the underside? Well, just I down. I don't think it's... There's stuff down there. Oh. Uh, I don't think it's the right stuff, though. Mm -mm. Ooh, did you hear a growling? It might have just been the generators. Could be. Ooh, what's that? Oh, oh some boxes. A, yeah, it's a juice box. Juice box? That's your name for the plasma? Yeah. I guess I got I did get the other one. That reminds me of how I sometimes have a hankering for fruit punch. It's just a unique flavor. It always tasted too processed for me. Mm -hmm. No, but I'm talking about the more natural fruit punch. Mm. Is, is fruit punch, I wonder if its most basic components are just, uh, oh, what would be a good uh, fruit pairing that would probably make it? I always thought it was a combination of grape and a citrus fruit. Maybe. But I'll admit, I pretty I much have never had fruit punch. Mm -hmm. It was not something my, my family... No. Aww. Maybe I can go the other way. Ooh, is that a skull? Yeah. Mm. It looks like a big kind of whale creature. Yeah. Whale, serpent, something very long. Okay. Let's get the other juice box. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. There we go. And back. There we go. And then I'll try going out the tail and not doofing it this time. There we go. Wait, was there something in its... I don't know. I always think that there's something in the oh. spinal column. Ah, there you go. You do have some places to lasso on, too. Yep. Missed that. Oh, this is the first uh, eye. Yeah. Oh. Huh. Okay. Well, you might get that one and then go have to go up. But there is that creature sitting there. Yeah, I was kind of hoping to do a bit of a... I was cleaning first. Yeah, there's a bunch of birds. There we go. It is nice that you can lasso yourself from one to the next to the next. Yep. Yeah, because if none of these birds are here, then but we have way less sailing. to fear. Okay, it's starting to it? activate. Oh, dang it. Yeah, watch out for the heat. It's starting to activate. Ooh. Not a problem if I'm here. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Climb up. Whoa, that's quite a number. Okay. There we go. Is that the eye? Yeah, having those extra boosts really speeds this up, like, tremendously. 
Now that is the multi-legged creature that's currently sitting on the next planetoid. Yeah. Or sphere. With the absolutely ginormous eye just kind of hanging out. Ugh, I'll never be clean. I didn't take any damage, so I don't need to worry too much. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that looks like it's on the interior here. What's on the interior? Oh, you mean something in the column? Yeah, nothing. Okay. The spine. So we know where two of the things are. I'm just going to keep looking. Oh, well, here's where a third is. Follow these. Hopefully, this will take me where I need to go. Did I get them? No. Oh, there's so much pretty there foliage go. around here. There we go. This place. This glorious place. I can still hear the choir's echoing praise. I can still smell the sacred incense. The roots of this growth were set down long ago. But I taste its fruit now. Today. Tufty thinks she can control the star seed with careful calculations and measurements. But the only way to unlock the star seed's power is to surrender to it. We must feed it everything we have if we want to be saved. Mm. Is that what the whole... Feed it everything? Is that what it takes to activate the star seed? That doesn't sound good. Mm hmm I mean, we do know that everyone thus far had been claimed in s whenever it was activated, or mm -hmm. whenever their conduits were activated. And even the very name, Conduits, was Pyat just getting everyone to set them up to feed their energies into the Starseed? Maybe? It took their lives? Really hoping we could. There we go. Yeah, there you go. That's good. Do I need to do this? Does this take me anywhere useful? No, in fact, it actually. We've been here before. Oh, that was productive. It's fine. We haven't actually gone in here yet. Nope. Haven't gone into the big creepy cathedral. Oh! We need the yellow spore for this one. A red spore for that one, but that's maybe to get through. These oh, are look at puzzles. that. There are three tubes. A blue one, a red one, and a yellow one. I wonder then, if we activate all this, will those tubes elsewhere spew out spores? I think those are just to indicate that... I think those are just to indicate that you need to have all of those spores on you simultaneously to get through. Mm -hmm. oh, I can see the inferences of where those other eyes will be. Well, we saw the big one open a while ago. Mm -hmm. But it's closed now. Huh. What were you? And why were you here? Juice. A poem written by Arik. Eric. Or Eric? Maybe. It was, no, it was Arik. You're right. When as in strands my cilia grows, then, then my spores how sweetly flow that liquefaction of thy molds. Well. 
Loves the mycelium, loves the mushrooms. That's for sure. I watched a whole documentary on Netflix about mushrooms and how, yeah, just the intricate networks of the mycelium. And actually, I'm really intrigued by the applications that, that they might have for creating, say, plastic alternatives. Because there's that one company. Oh. Hmm? Yeah, look, We're it's just spewing. supposed to get yellow spores to that. So it's it's a lock. The door doesn't react. It's purely we just have to take the spores to those locations. And then the door opens up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's a blue score. And now it's just open forever. Uh huh. That's good to know. Oh, there's another charger. But yeah, there's a company that's making. Uh, they essentially grow the mycelium into these molds that are essentially. It creates a completely organic styrofoam. Yeah. Essentially, except it's not, you know, made of. What was it styro scene or yeah something like that yeah so and yeah you can i think you can just crush it up after use and it biodegrades yep yeah, i'd really like to see more biodegradable tech we uh we try and recycle everything that we have but we know that only 10 percent of it actually gets recycled and that's oh, really no. sad so you have to go all the way around then ah oh that ran work. out I mean, you're still shedding spores. Got it. That's interesting. It actually opens up another spore. Ah. Okay, there's one. This is not as frustrating as I thought it was going to be. Okay. I keep expecting this to get, like, blisteringly difficult. Okay, so you just have to get the blue one now. And then the yellow. Have you found a yellow spore in this room? Yeah. Aw, oh, did you just miss it no, or I got did you it. get it? Okay. So I think the yellow might be the hardest. Ah, it's from its outside. I see. Got it. There you go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh boy. Where are you going? To the elders. Just stay focused, Ray. You've been in darker places than this. Ooh. Creepy. Don't. I almost don't want to use the shields so that... I mean, you don't need to use the shields at this point, but... Oh, did that... Did that light everything up? Yeah. A little bit of agitation makes them glow brighter. There we go. I wonder how much of a maze this place is going to be like. Well, they seem to stay lit. So it's maybe not so bad. It'd be so much worse if you couldn't. Mm hmm Oh. I mean, there's also dungeon candles. It's true. We really need to, to talk about dungeon candles at some point. Yeah. Every time we play a game and there's just candles. lit candles everywhere, you wonder, hmm, how oh. long has it been since some... Oh, wait. Oh. There's ooh. more of these, like, robot monks. Yeah, you're oh, right. Oh, these are the elders. I wonder if they're, like, literally robots that Feels worship like being the mycelium and become part of the hive minds. Mm. They are my. Oh, can you go back? I'm just lighting all this stuff. I think some of them have tilted over a little. They remind me of those Buddhist monks that. They die in a seated position, yeah. and then they just let themselves mummify 
in catacombs and various places. There was a poem, by the way, over on the left. Over here? Yep. Yeah. Twilight falls upon me. The necrotic blight of time. A soul no longer. Ah, so you need a yellow one there, or... Hmm. Oh, there is a yellow spore there. Yep. There we go. Oh, it activated a rail. Ew, well that looks like that that's the eye itself. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna mess with that for a moment. I think there's other stuff I gotta get first. There we go. More juice. And whatever this is. Ooh, is that an endless pit? You better be careful. Well, a bottomless pit, I should say. Yeah, look at that. And all the spiky spines. Was this whole cavern inhabited by these worm like creatures? Oh, no. no. Yep, you fell. It's okay. I think you should have grabbed onto the. What was it? There was a goop wall over there. Okay. That's to get back to where we were. And we need, we need the a red, red that's on the other side of this cavern, I believe. Yep, it's up there. Let's see. Nothing there. Wait. I don't know if you can jump up no. that. But... No, I can't. No matter how much I abuse my my boosting abilities. Yeah, I panicked when I was approaching the uh, the goop for a second because mm -hmm. it felt like uh, it looked like it had the red stuff. Mm -hmm. And so mm -hmm. I was afraid to be on it, but this was wrong. Uh, bap, burp, bap, yep, don't bap, go too swiftly. Bap. Alternatively, gotta go fast. I really love the music movement in this game. Mm -hmm. All right. Yep, there it is. Got it. Ooh, look at this chamber. Yup. Can you look around it first before you bring the yellow spore in? Sure. Yeah, so we just have more of the monks. A lot of tomes and writings. Yeah. Wait, wait, look up. Look up. Oh. You're right. Yep. Also a crystal. Juice. A lot of crystals, actually. There we go. Yeah, you can just grab on. Yeah, good spot. Would have been a pain to come back down for this one. Mm -hmm. There is poetry to this place. The reaches of the universe collected and working in concert, living their eternal rest in harmony. Is this a guiding hand? We came to destroy this void, but I do not wish to destroy a place of such beauty. Those of simple minds are at a junction. Tufty has given up on the start. Gozam seeks to tuck tail and run. They think too small. Our work here is not yet done. I don't know what you're up to, Pyatt. But we can sort this out. Mm. I still kind of wish this game had, had, like, a happier tone. Well, these are ruined worlds that have been sucked into the True. void. True. Like, I don't know. I, I guess to some degree. And I, I still wonder if... Oh, maybe you, I don't know if you could have used the line to help you there, but should be easier to get back this way. 
look, there's another tome. Oh, yeah. It's just, for such a beautiful and kind of fun game, the plot on this game is not happy. Oh, Felicity, to be set free from the cycle's cold duplicity, like dead cap, which does split and splay the biotic form of yesterday. To eat the living so it can grow is the only life it knows. For it will one day, too, be primordial stew for something new. Mm -hmm. Cycle of life, death, decay, consumption. There we got the eye in here. We did get the eye in here? I think so. No, we clamped onto it, but didn't actually do uh... anything to it. Don't you remember? No. Or was the eye in this room? Yeah, it was in that room. Really? Yeah. No. Maybe. No, I thought it was back a ways, wasn't it? Or... Ah, I'm getting all confused. That's oh, no. the eye, see? We never found it. Yeah, it's there. Is it behind a barrier? Muck or no? That's it. Oh, it's around the other side. Or you could have just jumped straight to the eye. I'm not sure. Wait for the nerve to reset. Yeah. Looks like it's a long cooldown. Mm hmm. You need to crawl under. Don't you? Or, oh. Is there another way up? Oh, I think I know it. We'll just wait. Maybe you should shed some light on this area. Or is, are these lit? No. No, they were. Looks like they unlit when we left. Mm-hmm. So light this one, because that would help. Yep. Okay. So I know, I know how to do this. Ah, so you're going to land directly on it. No. Uh -huh. <gasps> that was yeah. really... Oh, I, I think you had time, but I just saw the tendril go there and it was yep. really close. Two more. Yep, two One more. Two more. So what is juice used for? Unfortunately, it's kind of useless. Oh. Ooh, what's this? Do not know. Let's take a look around. It looks like a young sapling or something. Yeah. Or just part of the mycelium roots. Maybe the... Oh, wait. Is it a person? Oh. With mycelium coming out of it? No, this is to commune. I uh... think this is what happens when they properly fully fuse with it. Aww. Maybe. Are you going to talk to it? The elders. How does the spore song go? Um, it was... It was elders who dream. Elders who dream? In it was... Um, it was crepuscular infinity. infinity. In yeah. crepuscular infinity. Um... It was... Eternal Veil? I think it was the Eternal Veil. Part the Eternal Veil. And enlighten me. And enlighten me? Elders who dream in crepuscular infinity? Part the Eternal Veil? And enlighten me? I am the speaker for the silent. I died 27 cycles ago. My fingers entwined with my beloveds. I am Umbra. You reach out again, but have yet to spread your roots in the heart of another. Don't they know there's no one around to spread roots with? 
Umbra must engage in communion to achieve diffusion across the great gradient of selves beyond. Wait. You are not Ari. No, you are a soul that stands apart from their oneness, who loves not but their own ends. Your quest does not concern us. Uh, yeah, let's ask about the Echo. Have you heard of the being called Echo? Can you tell me anything about them? Please, lives are at stake. Curious. I will ask the Silent Ones if they know the origins of the entity of which you speak. Ah. Yes, we have seen endless cycles of their fruitless struggle. They have been removed from the cycles of life and death. However, we hear whispers from the ground that they smell of null. You smell of null as well. The Silent Ones can offer you nothing but contempt. I must comfort them. Leave this place. Well then. Weird. So yes, removed from life and death. And once again, the you smell of null, just as Echo does. Yeah. Null being nothing. Yeah, I wonder if this whole thing is kind of time loops. Mm -hmm. And we're supposed to be breaking it somehow. Oh. That was one of the doors that you couldn't open before? Yeah. Hmm. Well, well this is, now that you know about... This is the one... Oh, I see. Now Maybe. that you know about the spores, can we find a yellow spore to take up to the tower? Maybe. Give me a second, though. Okay. I want to get that log. Probably not actually... Yeah. That hard to get. Pull the log. At, oh, this log. I see. Yeah, why don't you hop up there? That's a bunch of. Can I? Oh, that's that's sad that you can't use those mushrooms to hop up. They're ever so convenient. Yeah, I know. They look like they could be little ladders. Good rock climbing walls. Well. Hmm. Oh. Maybe you can jump off the spine. Oh yeah, yeah. That's uh, it. I bet. How do you get on top of that one? Can you jump in the air to get onto one of those? Oh, that, that to the right. Yeah. This. This yeah, rib. Yeah, this yeah, rib yeah. will work. Or not. Uh, I can do it. Oh, oh! For a moment, you. Yeah. Dang ah, it. you fell too soon. Yeah. I don't think I'm supposed to do this. Uh, I think you had gone up the right side because there was that notch. You can always go up along whatever that structure is on the opposite yeah, side. Yeah, over there. Yeah, and then you might be able to jump onto them. Speed running tricks. Okay. Well, we got whatever this is. Other poem? For the last fortnight, I've watched a planet grow closer and closer to the Ultra Void. When I look up at it, I swear I can hear the sound of everyone I once loved crying out in pain. Is it the same sound on every planet? I do not fear death. Not any longer. But I cannot watch another world suffer as mine has. May it end swiftly. Paragon Dandipos. <laughs> There's just something hypnotic about how he says Terragon Dandipos. Terragon Dandipos. But I wonder what... Why would you... Under what circumstances would you be called Danderpaws? 
Is it is it that the paws are white? Or is it that they've been scratching too much on their scalp? Pyatt. Oh, wait. What did you do? What does Pyatt look like? Massive? And he has a beard? Definitely looks more sage -like. Well, he's... I think he might be slightly robotic, too. Mm. Or like crystal brain? Maybe? Maybe yeah. not. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm seeing tubes in the back. Yeah. And a backpack of some that sort. That might be part of his spacesuit. Mm -hmm. He is definitely big, though. And yeah, he's there. Well, what did he do? Well, he seemed to embrace whatever was coming. The neophyte has heeded my wisdom. We shall see the star seeds' glory in full relief. From the moment Tufty unearthed that ancient artifact, hope's seed was planted. Now, we see destiny fulfilled. The end of our time, the beginning of a new one. The light shines brighter than I could have imagined. To bathe in its scintillating rays at the end of the world is to experience the divine. Take us, Starseed, and grant our people safe passage. I have waited my whole life for the joy of revelation. Finally, here at the end, I feel it. If I find the rest of his logs, maybe I'll get the answer. Okay, so we need a yellow. Huh? Mm -hmm. To get up to the one in the far corner, that is. I Unless think I know where the yellow one. is. The question is, will it last long enough? And the answer is, I don't know. Are you thinking of going all the way from here to Gotta the... Be. Well, yeah. I mean, there's the tower. Uh, yeah. Got it. Yep. There you go. I'm fearing this void, villainizing it. But in here, I see all of this diversity, beauty. So many parts of the universe bonded by destiny. Holy places have a resonance to them, a resonance I am well familiar with, and this place positively vibrates with it. I was chosen to walk among these clouds. I believe. Yes, it is only fitting to place the star seed conduit at the foot of this shrine. Mm. Ooh, we got them all. Suit regained shield energy when enemies, when enemies are, destroyed. are destroyed. You want to see what you look like in it? Sure. Star seed didn't save Pyatt. Why did he have so much faith in it? Very gold. Gold and purple. Can you go back? I, there may have been a log in, like a poem in there, I should say. Just to make sure. It would have been on the left. No? Nope. Oh. 